What's going on guys? So today, uh, something came in in the mail, finally. My uh, Rough Country 4.5 inch uh, lift kit came in. Those are the springs right there. And also, these bad boys came in. They're uh, 15 by 12. They're freaking super heavy, so I can't really pull them out with one hand, but yeah, all four of those came in. My lift kit came in. I have, I bought extended brake lines, those came in. Uh, about 2 inch wheel spacers, those came in yesterday. Really, all I'm waiting for right now is my uh, tires. For tires, I got uh, Goodyear MTRs. So um, right now what we're doing is, uh, while we do the lift kit, we're gonna also do the uh, ball joints because those are all uh, bad too. So I'm gonna go ahead and go to AutoZone, buy the ball joints, and when I get back, I need to take all these vehicles out. That way we have room to do the, the lift kit, which is gonna be on this lift right there. Also, no flow Diego, he's gonna come over here and help me with this because I've never done a lift kit personally myself, so you know, he's done like millions of them. So we're gonna he's gonna come over here and it's like what time is it? It is it is 936 right now. So I'm gonna go ahead and try to call him. Uh, I took today off of work so we can go ahead and do this. That way if anything happens, we have the whole weekend to mess with it. So Diego also has today too, so I know he's home probably doing something, but I'm gonna go ahead and call him and see what he's doing. He's probably not, he's probably not even gonna pick up. Your call has been forwarded to it. Yeah, that's pretty typical. He never picks up my uh, phone phone calls. He's probably still sleeping right now. It's pretty early, but I'm just gonna go ahead and go to AutoZone, get the ball joints, and uh, start cleaning the garage a little bit. <laughs> Looks a lot cleaner now. Now we actually have room to pull the Jeep in, put on the lift, and get started. All right, guys, so uh, I just went ahead, took off all the wheels, started getting uh, everything set up. So all the wheels are off. And just to test, I put my 12-wide uh, wheel on there just to see how actually wide it is. And this thing is going to be crazy wide. That's literally like the whole, like half the uh, wheel poking out. Things gonna be crazy. What I'm worried is since this wheel is so freaking heavy, and I ordered the uh, MTRs, which are like the Kevlar uh, tire, I'm just worried something's gonna go bad. Dang, look at that. The man himself right there, standing there. <laughs> Got the pit freaking vipers on. Look at this dude right here. Dang. It's killing him. Oh, uh, what do you think? Yeah, just bring it anyways, just in case. Maybe a grinder too. All right, so I forgot the order. Access, access. Do you need those? You guys change them later. I mean, I can go, I can maybe go up to full apart. Well, I mean, is it smart to use them, reuse them? You think they're that bad? No, you can't. Okay, there's inner axle seals. Yeah. On stock axle. Yeah. More than the, like likely the chances we pull the axle shafts out, your axle seals are gonna blow if they're not blown already. Mm -hmm. So. So I need them. It's smart to get them, yes. Unless you want to keep filling your dish with food. All right, Christmas Day, 2018. Springs. Go check. Sway bar. Front shot. Banner. Yo! I'm putting that on the windshield, boy. I gotta represent. Yeah, rough country. Broke boy lift kit. Hey, wheels for the rich boys, the lift kits for the broke boys. Still got cheap wheels too. Cheap. 
cheap but they wide. That's how that's how I'm gonna do it. Lift kit for the broke boys, wheels and tires for the rich boys. All right, Diego. That's how we do it on no flow. You gotta you gotta do a happy medium for everybody. Sweet. You just know. If you know, you know. Things are heavy, right? Yeah. All that dish. I know, that's a long, that's a big dish. You better put a no flow sticker in there. I'm gonna do it. That's what I'm gonna do. Actually, I, I wasn't gonna do that, but now you said it, I'm gonna do it. Dang. Suspect the instructions. We need these. Yeah, to figure out what all those other bolts and shit's for. Oh yeah. Figure it on the way there. What is, what is new hardware? How long is it new? There we go. Clean. It's one out of leaf. Oh, two is one. Oh, two. Yeah. Some other stuff in here too. I can't get it off. Probably the. Rip. Oh, this is put all the, see, yeah, that's the centering pin. Mm -hmm. This is put all the leaf springs back right together. Yeah. Well, I mean, you can do the rear first and then work our way up or the other way around. You think we're gonna need Mayo said maybe not to, just rather, to make a squat. Yeah, it makes it rather like shit. You think it's gonna squat like crazy? You do? Well, I, you think I'm gonna clear 35s without that leaf? Well, all of those adjustable too, right? Yeah. What does that mean? Three to. Did you did you buy that leaf separate? No, it's it whole, kit, whole kit. Whole so, kit. Is it is a four inch lift? Yeah, four and a half. Squat like an inch. But I'll clear 35s. I gotta cut it anyway. Yeah, I've seen people clear 35s without lift kit, anyways. Yeah. Maybe cutting up the whole thing, but. Well, I guess we can just leave it like that for now. Yeah, I think we can just come back later and just do it. But what is gonna have to come up with the rear soy board? You have to do that? Yep. Okay. Yeah, take the rear one off. Yeah, make sure it links for the front. So, there. Um, so what we're gonna do here is we're going to You have ball joints? Yes. Where that? In my Jeep. Where? In the back seat. You tall man, you get him. Oh, is that a welder? <laughs> no, it's a battery charger. Really? It's it's in oh somewhere over there. Like in the corner. On the other side? Top, yeah. Most likely. Dude, I want my Jeep to be this high to be honest. Go mud bogging, boy. This is like a 20 inch lift. It's a couple feet lift. It's a couple feet. Now we're gonna do all this lift, just body lift, though. Isn't that how monster trucks people do? I mean, Middleburg, you know how many Middleburg girls I get with this hit, uh, high lift kit? None. I get all of them. Value oh, craft. Yeah, I'm broke, boy. Goofy. Lower. So you gotta take this thing off, right? Yes, you gotta take the action shaft off. That looks like some pain. Looks all rusted and crap. That's just a. That's called a castle nut. There's an actual nut under that nut. Oh. That's just all. Never mind. I don't even explain it to you. So, uh, <clears throat> we're going to AutoZone real quick. Get some W40. Most important tool, if you got it. 
I'm gonna get some food. Oh yeah, I want some food too. I'm gonna go wash my hands up. Yeah, after the quick stop at Wawa and shit, we came back. So the only thing we got off is the brake caliper, the brake rotor, sway bar, and links. And he's getting this shock off now. But then after that, we're gonna cut the stock springs out, take off the track bar, then do the control arms, and get the new springs, shocks, and tighten up everything because I'm feeling more than one of these bolts are loose. You having fun? Yeah, a little bit. It's hot as crap out here. Getting the control arms off. And then the springs. Ain't that right? Yeah. Cool. It's out. Er, the other control arm's out. Yeah, it took, a, it took forever. I think it's, I think it was on there. We got it out. Now, what's next? Uh, raise the truck. Stop. We gotta take out the spring return. Alright. We gotta get the impact. So, another thing is... We don't know when his tires are gonna be here because, uh... Yeah. People at the shipping company, they, they said the tires, the tire, the people that have the tires aren't talking to them pretty much. So, we don't know when his tires are gonna get here and that's gonna suck. Now we're in focus. So, we don't know when tires are going to get here. We don't even know if they've been delivered yet. So, he's going to be lifted on this rollers until his tires get here. Ain't that right? Yeah, that's right. For now, at least for now. For now, he says. Okay. We're going to get this spring out. And then... The coils, the new coils and new control arms and brake lines and shit like that. No, yeah, kind of. Find it out, figure it out. Yeah. Here, wait. <laughs> All right, guys. So, bottom control arms are going in. Diego's taking a little break. He's dead. I broke Diego. Now uh, we're putting the uh, control arms in right now. We're gonna put them in one end like that. That way we can then slide the springs in. And then we'll just put every, push everything up and start bolting everything together. Um, I don't know if we told you guys, but we decided not to do the rear lift. Just because when I bought the car, it already came with a three inch uh, lift kit. So it already has the uh, shackle and uh, we're thinking it maybe came with it's already added, the leaf is already added, but if not, that's fine because I'll I'll get like a maybe a two one to two inch uh, my rear would be one to two inches lower than my front, so it makes it squat a little bit, which is kind of what I wanted. You know, it's a street street uh, XJ hot boy, wide boy, so uh, wanted to be a little bit little squat a little bit. So you need spring compressors. Yeah, and while we're back there, we're gonna bring these back since we're not doing the ball drive removal tool. Dude, they wanted like, they, my, the rent for this is like 250 bucks. Yeah, dang. Good thing I got paid. Screw it. Oh, I should forgot something. Forgot the keys. When your, uh, when your manager's never there, there always has to be one guy there, right? Saying out back. Huh? Saying out back. You're gonna do four, freaking mount four wheels and expect them not to come back and watch it? Yeah. Them? It's impossible. Really? I mean, if you get fired, who cares anyway? You got 10 bucks? 
because I got ten dollars. I own the freaking treasury of the United States of America. Huh. I got the whole entire freaking I don't know. Really? Literally the national debt. US national debt is towards me. The US government owes me trillions of dollars. Alright, what's up? So, uh, we just got back from, well, not we didn't get back, we just got out of AutoZone. <clears throat> we got the spring compressors, we turned in the ball joint tool, because we're not, we're not doing those just yet. And uh, we got some drinks. <sighs> Sponsor? I wish. We got sponsored by Sprite. My blood we made out of Sprite. What's that spicy water? But yeah, we're on our way back. So recording. Yeah. yeah, we're on our way back right now to the house. Uh, we got the spring compressors, so we're gonna do those. You know, hopefully the right ones. Diego, Diego says they are. But you know. Also, uh, no flow number three. Cameraman Will's Pruitt's over there, are at the house. So go meet up with him. Make him do some work. Cause you know he's clean. And he's gonna be like, man, I'm tired. No, I don't know. I'm getting these crispy shots right now, bro. Wait till you see it in editing. Yeah, I'm not gonna go. Meet. <laughs>